All right. You may have heard the generic elevator t chime featured, um, especially with like EPCO, monitor controls, and so on and so forth um, equipment. This, this thing is probably installed on almost, oh, maybe 100,000 elevators in America. This one, um, everybody sells these. This one was resold through EPCO, but uh, they're manufactured by CE Electronics. I'll post a link in the video info to um, some wiring diagrams and also their website. This particular unit, although you can order it in a bunch of different voltages, this one takes 48 to 120 volts um, alternating or uh, direct current, which is actually pretty nice. This has three wires. The um, They can either be, be used for either a positive or negative. So a positive or negative return is the black wire used for both signals. For the up signal, um, uh, this brown wire is used for the um, well the opposite polarity of the black wire. And so for safety reasons, I um, I can in America I can because we use 115 volts uh, alternating current I can ho just hook it up right to the mains power. However, I'm using a surge protector as a switch for safety reasons. So here's uh, the what the down or the up signal sounds like. Um, the current models, well, many websites, uh, this is featured on EPCO's and um, CE Electronics website. What they show is, um, I think it might just be that it's a black and white picture, but it, anyways, it's, the pictures show it as being gray. This has a little screw to adjust the volume, so. And here we'll try the red wire. Now many controllers work off of sending actually two signals, turning the switch on, on quickly off, then on again for the remainder of uh, the elevator's time at a particular floor. However, some of them do send it are miswired, and if you've ever heard it go, nah, 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 that's because it's sending two signals through the down wire, even though it only needs to send one. So it's um, error on the really the part of the wiring. So here's a down signal. Now this is what, it, uh, this is the error with um, many controllers. That's more like it. So here's here. I'll play it again. Let's get a view of the box here. Blue plastic. There's a screw. It uses a uses just a flat screw for adjust adjustments. Epco gong. Plus or minus 48 to 120 volts AC or DC. There it says. This is it. This probably weighs about. This probably weighs only about. Gosh, probably maybe uh, 20 to 40 grams. Not that much. So that's about it.